Sophia was Orson Dahlia and uh, Maggie Maraschino. Is that right, Maraschino? Is that how you pronounce that, Maraschino? And if you liked what you saw, you can see more of it at the Midway Cafe on April 2nd. They're doing a show there. It's called The Time Strip. It's a, a burlesque show time-traveling for less show, rather, and it should be pretty fantastic. Uh, now, next up, I know she just was up here, but I'd like to, is that okay right there? Right. I'd like to welcome, once again to the stage, Sofia Cassiola and her boo, Michael J. Epstein. Put your hands together. Sophia Cassiola project, another Sophia Cassiola side project, another Sophia Cassiola this. In fact, on my band, on the Michael Jepstein Memorial Library, people have told me that they think that you write all of my songs. Mike, I don't think anybody really thinks that. So, so, I've heard people say this. Mike, you're being silly. No, so, I, I was in involved in music years before we were married. I mean, I mean, are you talking about that silly goth band you had in college? Look, binary test record had a great following in Binghamton, New York. I was small, but it was very vehement. I, I have an idea. Let's ask Facebook what they think. <laughs> Facebook? What's that? It's that social media site I made you sign up for when we got together. Oh, okay. I mean, does that really do anything? I'll show you. Wait, wait. Who's that person that has my name on Facebook? What? He posts all this random stuff. So, have you been posting my account on Facebook all these years? Somebody had to promote our shows. <laughs> so, what, what is this? Look, look, Mike, let's just ask. Let's just ask. Okay, so I'm going to write Facebook. Who do you think does more work? <laughs> Mike or Sophia? Send. Okay, so how does this work? All right, so, so I send out all of my thoughts onto Facebook, and then Facebook adds its thoughts to my thoughts, and then it becomes this whole big pool of people's opinions and ideas and poor spellings, and it's this great thing. And capital letters. And, and all capital letters. So, An exclamation point. So it's like, so it's like the Borg, is what you're saying. Yeah. It's like the Borg if the Borg was full of narcissists. <laughs> okay, okay, people are commenting. People are commenting. Hmm, that's weird. It doesn't, WTF, WTF, IDK, IDK, question mark, 
a Simpsons video, a wall cat, raffle copter, WTF, nudes or get the fuck out. Uh, wait, wait, Jade Sylvan said something. Jade Sylvan? She's weird. Well, I know, I know, but wait, what did she say? All right. She said, the reason people use one name to define the both of you is because they don't recognize you as individuals. They see you as dualistic manifestations of a single entity, such as the uh, Hindu deities that are consorts, such as Brahma and, uh, and Saraswati, or Vishnu and Lakshmi, or Shiva and Parvati. Yeah! What the fuck does that mean? I have no idea! But... But... I think so. F I think what it means to me is that we need to start to forge our own identities. Our own identities. W what would that look like? Are you saying you want to break up with me? No, sir, no. I'm not saying that. I'm saying that I need to sit on that stool without you. Okay, Mike. If that's how you feel.